Hello, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, well, uh, depending on where you are. As usual, today, um, we're going to share with you the top 10 assets we have on our watch list for this coming week. And uh, please, if you have uh, followed the last week uh, watch list, and if you managed to make some profit with that watch list, with that is what we have on uh, I watched for the last week, of course, USD Japan Yen, it made a very, very huge move, as you can see it here. Well, let me ray with a moving average for those who trade with a moving average to give you more insight. Uh, let me use it for 50 moving average. We had the USD Japan Yen, it made a very, very strong clean move. We had the Euro Japan Yen, it made a very clean move last week. Euro orders the same. Uh, we managed to make uh, this move at the beginning of the week, and then we got uh, this pullback, which I think you can even continue to trade it in this upcoming week because we are on our area of value. We had the GBP Japan Yen. You could see the big move we have a push up where we had the last week. Um, GBP card is one of the pay on watches which have a for which has not performed well, of course. Okay. But GBP already made this very nice move up, okay? Cut Japan Yen as well as cut Japan Yen. You see how we made a very nice moves. This is how preparation ahead of time make a difference when you are trading, okay? Uh, if you have uh, traded according, if you have uh, traded according to this watch list that have been provided the last week, Please comment below, tell us if a pair which you have um, traded, okay? And tell us how it helped you to make uh, profits or loss if you made a loss. Of course, it will help us to know how we can uh, improve what we are providing to you, okay? Uh, without delaying, let's start with um, the watch list of this week. And of course, if you are new and it is your first time or to watch uh, our YouTube channel, please hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so that you do not miss any program of uh, UTC. So without delaying, uh, DXY last week, it made a very strong move and it has shown that uh, bulls are um, controlling the market. Okay, so we are bullish on Dora index now. Since it has broken this trend line over here, uh, which was acting as um, resistance, okay? And we managed to make this push up and you see we have broken 50 exponential moving average. So we are waiting on a pullback to this support, okay? And then if you get it, and we, with the entry trigger over here around 101.5, we're going to look for buying opportunities. So contrary to last week, where all uh, most of our currency pairs on the watch list was based on uh, Japan yen, because the Japan yen was very, very weak last week, because even till today, um, Audi, New Zealand, and um, Japan, yen, Odia, and New Zealand, they are very weak on the watch list. Today, uh, we are going to focus more on USD, and without further ado, let's start with USD, Japan, yen. USD, Japan, yen was, of course, um, was in this downtrend, and they broke this trend, which was acting like a support, resistance, sorry. So if we could get the pullback uh, this week on... Um, Around 0 0.85, we will look for pullback toward the quarter pivot point or to this area resistance. Uh, USD Japan yen it is again on our watch list today. Okay, it has also broken this trend line. It broke this trend line, and uh, you see the how strong uh, bullish trend, uh, how it is very strong uh, bullish, and it's making uh, already, uh, it has already made one, two, three moves. Okay, for those who are using um, 
moving average you can use 20 moving average you receive that USD Japanese this is strong bullish therefore uh, this broken resistance could turn support uh, during this week so therefore if you get a pullback at this support along the 145.96 we'll look for continue through before by alternatives uh, the next uh, pair on our currency pair on our said on watch list on this week it's euro japan yen it came back again to this market last week we managed to make this uh, nice profit okay and uh, now we have this broken resistance which can turn support if you could get the pullback here so a pullback at this broken resistance which can turn support with a bullish um, reversal pattern will be a very nice uh, uh, trade opportunity because as we mentioned we have a resistance around 146.19 that is where we will be looking for target profit this uh, time um usd card also is on our list for this week um you see very well how it broke this resistance trend and it was acting like a support resistance and it is already making a pullback um therefore if we could get if we get a pullback during this week along this broken trend line which it could return support you can go too far we will be able to see clearly how this market is turned into resistance um bullish okay we will look for buy opportunities if we look at the test of this trend line okay for those who are familiar with trend line bounce um this is uh trend line bounce trading strategies the next uh, currency pair on our tourist it is new zealand the usd of course as i said most of our uh set uh, watch list this week they are based on the usd you see, uh, New Zealand the USD was up trend for some times, and then it managed to broke and close below this deep continuation support. Okay, currently it is at this deep pullback support. So, um, if we could get a bearish signal at this yearly pivot this was already the 2024 pivot we do expect the news around the west to continue pushing lower of course this is not um we are not the fortune tellers this is based on the fundamental of us dollar and of course and when the, the technicals of new zealand usd so will it be we are bearish on new zealand usd especially when we get a bearish Reverse of candles to keep pattern at this resistance around the 062.22. You know, New Zealand, it's also now at our watch list for this um, week. Okay, because you know, New Zealand was um, consolidating for the period of more than uh, 45 days and the calendar, it broke and closed above this resistance of the consolidation. So this is a signal that the bulls uh, have gained the power and the control of the market and they are willing to continue uh, pushing up. And for those who are familiar with candlestick patterns, you see these uh, three rising methods, chart pattern, which is a bullish signal. Therefore, if we could get the latest of this resistance, we'll continue looking for buy alternatives in uh, Euro New Zealand, okay. Um, GPP OD, uh, since OD is uh, still weak on the uh, fundamental, it's still on our watch list, okay. It broke this continuation resistance and tested our deep pullback resistance, and we are considering this. Um, this break here below as a force a breakout. Therefore, if New Zealand USD retest this support around the 1.9, we will look for the 
by opportunities okay this is where we are going to look for by opportunities and we're gonna target of course this resistance around the 197 as the target profit and in terms of indices uh for this week we pay much attention on uk 100 uh, because UK 100, as you see, it was in the range for 2023. It was nearly for the range since starting on uh, July. It was in the range. And uh, if you switch from to lower time frame, like a four hour, you see that the US UK 100 is now currently um, bearish. We are trending below to 50 moving average. They're making the lower lows and the lower highs. Of course, this is on our watch list for this week. We'll continue, we'll see uh, if we could get a uh, bearish move and retest here. And we will continue to look for sell opportunities in the UK. A hundred, okay? The last uh, set on our watch list for this week, which we are starting tomorrow, is US 2000. US 2000 for the last year, it was in a complete range. And for those who follow us regularly, we shared this asset um, several times, okay? You could see how this asset was in the range starting the mid-20 from April 2022. This asset was in the range, and currently it uh, gave us a force breakout to signal to this resistance along the 2030. So we do expect this market to continue pushing lower with a stacking and trading um, strategy. And uh, if we analyze this upper trend here, you see we had an upper trend here, which um, where this trend line was acting like a support. And currently it is broken. So we do expect a retest of this trend line and continue pushing lower to this yearly pivot and so on. We do expect up to now to continue selling um, US 2000, okay? So these are the top 10 assets on our trust for the week ahead. And of course, as I mentioned, some of the assets we analyzed the previous week, they do still have the trading opportunities. You can go to the GP channel and check all the, those markets they are here, okay? And most of them are related to Japan yen. And Japan yen, of course, it is still uh, down very weak. But since they are going to make um, pullbacks in this week, that's why we do not have them on watch list calendar. Okay. But still, they do still present the trading opportunities. Okay. Please, if you are watching this video and you have a problem, comment below to this video. We'll be happy to give you more so further explanation on the markets you might be interested on. And if you have any asset which is on the top 10 uh, watch list, which you want us to help you to analyze, comment below to this video. We'll be very glad to give you our overview technical and the fundamental overview on your asset, okay? <clears throat> and if you are struggling to enter because analyzing a market trend bias area of value, it is one part, but it is not all. Uh, at UTC, we have developed the system, a trading system which we call T-A-E-S-T. Trading system we call T-A-E-S-T, where T is the trend, A, area for value, E is entry, S stands for stop and target, okay? And with this complete system, you, nothing will stop you to make money. And if you are a struggling trader and you want to take your trading uh, um, career to the next level, we encourage you to consider our Manifisha course. You can go to www.traders.lw and then go to Manifisha. We're going to teach you everything related to... Technical analysis, kind of skip pattern, technical analysis, support and resistance marketers, uh, trend line, trending indicators. We teach you also six proven trading strategies which have edge over the market. We teach you backtesting, trading journal, risk management, 
Training psychology, of course, will teach you how to make uh, um, the trading plan. And we do believe that after you complete this course, you can become a professional trader. And uh, of course, this is a mentorship program. It is paid for $499, okay? And if you are not able to pay this uh, um, mentorship fee, it's totally fine to us. We continue to give you uh, free content, yet that are very, very accurate without uh, any hidden information. Thank you very much for following us. And thank you very much for watching this video. If you are new, don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you'll be notified whenever we release any new content on our YouTube channel and uh, hit the notification bell and share, you will be supporting our YouTube channel. Thank you very much. See you next time.